Hello everyone, this is Ed Zahagin the Alliance for Loki. And today I just want to do a little bit of shopping in the store, the Modoc store. So I have 2,894 of these coins, which is a lot. Um, I've been buying the, um, the daily, um, daily little special each day. It's giving me 60 coins. I got a lot for the Intel I had uh, bought in the other event. And so, so yeah, I have a fair amount, so I should be able to buy about everything I want. Um, so let's go through here. We'll just go by an order of sort of priority. Um, so I really want tier two alpha because I feel like I'm gonna need a lot of those. So, and that's probably the most expensive. So I'm gonna buy both of these at 760 and I'll buy all four of these, which is basically two of them. Okay. So that put a pretty big dent in my, in my uh, gold coins. And okay, let's buy all 10 of these. That's pretty cheap. That's fine. I okay, just want lots of rank up rewards, resources for um, for the um, the uh, trying to think of um, the four of July. Let's go ahead and buy all five of these. Never can have enough. I feel of uh, tier four basic, and they're pretty affordable. I'm gonna hold off on the tier five basic. That's sort of the last thing I'll buy if I have if I have enough um, enough of the gold coins left. Uh, trying to think. Um, the Awakening Gem, well, I can't buy it anyway, so I guess everyone will think about it. Uh, let's see what other things are there. Could get the stones. How many does 20 of these cost? Um, 320. Okay, so now we have 974 left. So that's 320 there. Let's see, 320. And let's see if we got all this. That's also 320. Doesn't seem like it's worth it just because those aren't nearly as good as the generic. So that's 640. Okay. Do want to buy these tier four class selectors? Let me just see uh, which one I need the most. That's probably the next priority. Um, I think, uh, yeah, these things seem to be going quickly. Um, probably Mystic is going to be one of my next rank ups, but you never know. I mean, if I get a. Um, if you get a just any tier five class catalyst, um, so skill on low on and mystic and science. Um, hmm, maybe I'll buy one science, one and one uh, skill. Okay, I think I can buy three. Maybe I'll buy two science. Science seems like it might be a little more usable right now. So back to the store. Let's buy um, two science and one mystic. I mean, I'm sorry, one skill just to keep it even as much as we can. So it's always hard because one big rank up can like basically blow everything out. So it's here for a selector. There it is. Oh no, that's yeah, tier four, okay. Get it now, I guess I should have all three of them. And let's say it's by two science, because as I said, I think those might be a little more useful. Could see gain a science catalyst and there's a bunch of rank ups I'd like to do. Let's buy, let's see if we just can't buy two of them. Save us some time. Oh, uh, we'll get the science and let's grab the skill as well. And so, so that brings me up to a little bit more of each of those. And okay, that's all of those I can buy. So now with what we have left, what do we have left? 614, I guess I could buy all those five stars. Couldn't quite buy them all. Um, again, the, uh, the thing about the uh, tier five basic is I feel like I get those from Glory. Um, and just from from other places, and it's not really that much. Three thousand is not a whole lot. Yeah, you know, for four hundred eighty, I don't really feel, I find that value is particularly good. And so, yeah, let's just spend the rest in uh, in tier five. Um, and uh, sorry, um, five star signature stones. So let's get all twenty of these. Always, always can be useful just for ranking up characters. I can, and what does that bring me to? 294, okay, let's get as many of the stones as we can out of these. And so, uh, oops, that can't, that is 18 of them, which is great. Okay, and I'll make some more uh, of these gold coins. The thing that's been nice actually is I've actually bought, you know, bought one of these already. It's actually pretty useful when you're trying to do some rank ups. So maybe you just, whatever I've left, I'll, spent on like tier one and tier two class catalysts because they're so cheap and I always seem to need those and they're not so easy to get without doing a quest on the right day of the week. Everything else in here, like I'm not too worried about shards. I get shards all the time from various things. Um, as I said, the five star awakening crystal, I have uh, several awakening crystals including two generics so I don't feel like that's really a pressing need. 
but no, I like the things I've, I've purchased for um, for the costs I've gotten. So yeah, it's a really nice store. I think there's lots of good value in here. Of course, you know, you just can't have enough rank up rewards, or rank up resources ever. So so yeah, that's uh, it's been a, a cool event. Um, I still actually have a lot of the uh, Modoc Labs to do. How many of these? I still have nine. So I'll have a fair amount more of the uh, gold coins to spend. But I just want to go ahead and spend some now. Um, just to like see what I have in my resources and sort of start preparing for 4 July. So hope you enjoyed this video, this shopping trip to the Modoc store, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. This is Enzo Eigen of Alliance for Loki. Wishing you a good day. Bye-bye.